Welcome to RV and Travel Adventures. My name is Jesus Manuel Menegarza. Hope you're having a fantastic day. In this edition, I explore something new, a KZ Escape E20 hatchback model. It's an award-winning new travel trailer for 2021. Its unloaded vehicle weight is 3,510 pounds, so you can probably tow it with a truck or a large SUV. The exterior width is 7 feet 6 inches, the exterior length 23 feet 8 inches. Don't forget you can pause this video at any time because I shot it in 4K for your visual pleasure. The bed is 86 inches uh, by 74 in the king bed configuration, but in the twin bed configuration it's only 32 by 74, so you have the option. Let's take a quick spin around this unit. Up front, uh, you have a nice little uh, automotive style windshield, nice little window to the world. In the back there, you got the usual bumper for the stinky slinky. And uh, in the back is the business end, a very nice hatch where you can uh, add uh, your little toys uh, through this little mosquito netting. You just open that up, you unzip that, and then you can put your toys in there, be it bikes, canoes, kayaks, or just more stuff that you need to take along for your adventure. Let's take a peek inside. Walking in immediately to the right is the twin bed configuration. Of course this can be readily uh, configured for uh, a king size bed and when I say king size I'm saying seven foot and almost two inches long. And if you're that big you can fit in this uh, rather readily. I would recommend getting a thicker mattress if you're a big boy or a big girl. Uh, I'd suggest uh, upgrading these mattresses. Maybe just make it a full-time bed in the back back here. So let me pan the camera. I got this video from the KZ RV website. I uh, got pieces here and there and edited them together for this YouTube video. Hope you like it. If you have any questions, feel free to contact the folks at KZ RV. They have one of the better websites. I really like their website. I thought it was an excellent website. Very easy to you know maneuver inside there and check out different aspects get close-ups and these little you know videos that uh, offer you various uh, you know looks at the various features I really appreciated it here's a shot of the kitchen area you get a very nice uh, stainless steel sink nice cabinetry solid wood door fronts with uh, that uh, you know oil rub bronze look faucet also matches the uh, other hardware. Get a nice little window there. To the right is one of the aspects of this uh, unit I would change. That little stovetop needs to be uh, flush mounted. That's a definite $50 upgrade I would suggest to the manufacturer. Get a nice Furion microwave. To the right, you get a refrigerator. So I think it's a Norcold, if I'm correct. I don't know if it's an AC-DC, or if it's a DC, or it's propane and electric. I do not know. This is a question for your uh, KZ RV dealership. It's a very nice uh, pantry area. You can put your canned and packaged goods in there. Why not? Just put them in there. Got plenty of storage and a nice door to cover up stuff and a little odds and ends. So let's go inside the business end, the area where you're going to put your uh, toys, your kayaks, your boats. Again, you have to be very cognizant of the fact that you can't, you cannot <laughs> overburden this. This is a small, relatively small uh, travel trailer. There's a shot of the refrigerator and you get a nice view from the back here towards the front. The kitchen on the right, the bathroom on the left, and way, 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 way back there's that gigantic bed. Again, this area in the back can be converted from a uh, you know, lounge area with uh, plenty of seating to a dining area, to a storage area, to a, an area where you can also have a bed. Nice uh, cabinetry, solid wood uh, door fronts with uh, metal handles. And this is that netting I was talking about. You can have a nice view of the lake shore or the ocean and keep the bugs out. That's always a positive, don't you think? On the floor you got areas where you can attach uh, you know, bungee cords or any kind of 
device to uh, hold your vehicle in place. There they are, you can see one down there. So you're prepared for every eventuality. Don't forget there's plenty of room for bicycles, canoes, kayaks, etc. But don't forget uh, that uh, things add up. You only have 890 pounds of cargo carrying capacity. So uh, be forewarned. Here's a restroom. Nice looking toilet, nothing much on the walls, no, uh, you know, what do you call, uh, what's that term? Medicine cabinets. No medicine cabinets, no uh, linen storage or anything like that. But this is a good size shower with a shower curtain. So I'd like to know what you think. Don't forget to leave your kind and super friendly comments below the description. I would greatly like to hear what you think about this unit. Again, I really like this design. It's multifunctional. You have two sleeping areas. You have a, a area to have a large area to have dining. And of course you can have uh, store all your toys way in the back. Again, this bed is seven feet, two inches. Here it is converted. Of course you would take off all that plastic. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. I would greatly appreciate it. And please leave your kind and super friendly comments uh, below the description. They are always appreciated. This has been a walkthrough from the, for the 2021 uh, KZ Escape E20 hatch. It's an award-winning new travel trailer for 2021. What do you think? My name is Jesus Manuel Menagarza. Thanks for watching my short little video. Gracias. Adios. Bye-bye.